Hello. About a week or so ago, I put together a little project. I thought it was pretty much a fun thing to do anyway, and I thought I'd share it. Uh, this is a pendulum. I'm going to try and show you the circuit here. You see that all right? On my little pegboard there. And I'm running it with a bottle cap battery I put together. Nothing but Elmer's glue all, white glue. Uh, a little uh, Epsom salt and a little bit of salt substitute. I put it in there in layers. I mixed the first layer and uh, put the uh, magnesium ribbon in the center there. And then I, put, I left that dry and then I put in two or three more layers, just sprinkled in a little Epsom salt, a little substitute salt, and then more glue and I just did that two or three times. I think it's really working good. It's putting out over a volt and a half. I'm doing the first test run on it now <laughs> with this little pendulum. I got a feeling it's going to run for over a month, but we'll find out. Anyway, here's the uh, circuit for it. Put a pendulum. Another picture of it up here. If I can get it in there to show you. Hopefully you can see that all right. I got this uh, circuit from Solarbotics. They call it the Pendulum of Doom. Uh, right there. <laughs> the Pendulum of Doom. The coils for it, I sent away and I got them from that outfit. Uh, they were like two and a half bucks a piece. I ordered three of them, but I initially I just wrapped small coils and, and it worked. You know, actually when I first started the coils were too big and I just kept making them smaller and smaller and pretty soon they worked pretty good. But these are the ones that were actually made for this kit if you bought the kit. Anyway, it's pretty neat and I thought I'd share it with everybody. Uh, it's been it's been running for a long time now. Let me uh, get back a little bit here so you can see the thing in operation. <laughs> it works pretty good. It just goes 24 hours a day. Never stops. I made two of them. I got another one up here. I can show you quick. <laughs> it's a much bigger, a taller one. It's behind it is my Bedini wheel. Well, you see it back there. Uh, I'm running it with one of my homemade batteries. <laughs> it's just a copper tube with a strip of uh, magnesium ribbon in the center of it. A pill bottle or a prescription bottle filled with the sterilized water. And that's all it is. It's nothing else. The sterilized water. And that thing is working good. Okay. The, uh, I just did a video uh, yesterday on my snap battery batteries the first try. So today I'm doing a test on them. Let me put this back on flower here. And they've been running since early this morning. I had two of them set up running. One off of each battery that I made. I'm suspecting they're going to run for a long time because the voltage hasn't hardly dropped even hardly a little bit since early this morning. I'll test them and see how long they go. Well, anyway, I used uh, on these things here, I used nylon string or thread actually to put them on. And this pin in the top. I just did a snug fit drill on that, so getting the thread exactly the right length to get it pretty close to that little magnet down below there was a little tricky, so but all I have to do now is just turn that pin on the top and that winds up the thread and I can set it any length I want. Works neat, fun thing to do. That's about it. 
Thanks for watching.